of this exercise is to teach the dog to retreat to a specific location and remain there until you release them. In a home environment, what we use is a dog bed, traditionally, or just a place for the dog to go. A lot of times, owners get hung up on using the dog's crate or kennel, and that's not necessary. We didn't get a dog to have it in a crate for the entirety of its life. So what we want to do, okay, what we want to do is teach the dog to move to a very specific location. What is that? That's the pager part. That's right. What we want to do is teach the dog to move itself to a very specific location and remain there. When we introduce the command, it doesn't matter what type of training the dog has already had, transitionally when they go home, we request the owners have the dog on a leash and collar throughout the day when they are not in their crates so that you can reinforce these behaviors. You'll hear me say that a lot. If your dog is at home and you are there and present mentally and physically to help guide your dog through some problems that you're experiencing, your dog is on a leash and collar, at least preferably leash and collar and e collar so that you can control the outcomes of their choices. If not, you're leaving, you're preoccupied with another task, to simply have your dog in, your, in her crate so that she can't engage in the wrong behavior. But back